Hello everyone and welcome back to Halo Infinite. In the last session we reached the command spire but we have to take out a bunch of these thingies, beacons, before we can actually access it. So that is what we are going to be doing today. That is the plan. First up, let's head over there and hit FOB November and uh, then let's go from there. Need so. Backup? If we're hitting a base, what do we want to take? I want to take a battle rifle for my normal weapon. And I want to take Let's freaking go. the absolute classic that is the volatile skewer for my secondary. Love this thing. Absolutely adore the volatile skewer. And uh, yeah, that's the plan for today. We will see if we can huh, get this place opened up. I imagine this is going to take quite a bit because we have to go all the way around this section of the map. And uh, not only do we have to go all the way around this section of the map, but it has multiple uh, FOBs and more importantly, one of the big boy bases. And we'll probably be doing the big boy base today. So uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Well, you just got fucked on. Fun fact, it's slightly faster to drive diagonally than it is to uh, drive straight on in the ghost. Heads up, Chief. Another fog platform. Let's make it ours. Hello, I think I'll have your wraith. Okay. Wraith feels pretty good in this game. Fun fact, I'm level like 49 in the battle pass. I've played a absolute ton of multiplayer. This is the first time I've ever got to see a Wraith. Not see, sorry. I've seen a Wraith before. I've seen a Wraith maybe three times. This is the first time I've ever got to drive a Wraith. And it feels pretty good. But yeah, in a big team battle, the, the good vehicles never spawn. <laughs> like, I don't know what they're doing. But if you would like to see a tank or a wraith, you best play about a hundred games of Big Team Battle and maybe you'll get one on the hundredth. Not about that. Who's been fucking electrocuting me then? Who's been fucking electrocuting me? You? November's ready for capture. Clap. Broom. Captain Lasky, this is FOG 525. Do you read? I've got you, 525. Report. Sir, it was an ambush. The banners swarmed us. But do you have any estimates on the size of their force? Okay, how many craft do we need to contend with? They're dropping occupation units by the hundreds. The Banners didn't just come for us. They came for everything. And thus a sad day was had by all. Fob capture complete, Chief. 
For most of the war, this was about as deep in banished territory as the UNSC could reach. Oh god, there's two the targets. Like trying to protect this fob from the banished? So many lives sacrificed. Okay, what have we got? We've got Zeratus, who has a rocket launcher, and we have Arthok, who has a Ravager. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, Zeratus, one of the most senior officers in the Banished. Zeratus, known to his peers as the Scourge Maker, was among the first to join the faction after Atriox made his stand against the Covenant. Since then, he's been a critical component of Banished exploration efforts, leading numerous operations to scour Forerunner relic sites in search of critical assets and destroying anything that stands in his way. In one such operation on the ocean moon Lagalim, Zeratus ordered the sinking of a UEG research colony in pursuit of an ancient forerunner site beneath the seas. Of the 1,244 scientists and analysts stationed there, none survived. And it gets a tracking rocket launcher. Oh god. So he's going to be using that on me, huh? And Arthok. The Jurulhane champion known as Arthok has wreaked havoc on UNSC operations for the better part of a decade, first serving under Korth the Render, part of the Brothers of Unending Aya. Arthok led nearly four dozen individually documented assaults on colonial sites. The most notable was a vic vicious ambush on the colony of Tersira Ter that claimed the lives of three full ODST squads. Recent intelligence reports indicate that Arthok joined the rest of the Brothers of Unending Aya in pledging allegiance to Atriox and the Banished. Their motives are currently unknown, but each member should be considered an extreme threat to any UNSC forces that might be in close proximity. Received and understood. Coming in clear. You guys need anything? Uh, no, I'm good. We still have a shitload of skewer. Yes, we do. Good, good. Okay, so. Let's hit up that, and then 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 these guys. Sound good? Sounds good to me. Okay. Oh, uh, it's up there. Okay. How deep is this water? Like, can we go swimming? What's the deal? It's just not very deep. Okay, that's the deal. Nice. Fuck off. What now, Chief? Should we start hunting down those beacons, or did you have something else in mind? Spartans, if anybody can hear me, I'm proceeding. We've come too far to turn back. Interesting, the sentinels are out. That's directly below us. So we'll get that on the way back, I guess. There's a few big boys around here, huh? One more point, right? Yeah, one more point, and then we have invisibility. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so up to the end. There we go. We need to get inside the beacon. Let's find a way in. I 
I didn't realize these parts were going to be big fights as well. Oh shit! Oh shit, that hurts. Damn it! Damn it! Oh man. I just took so much damage as I was flying towards the the shade turret. There we go. We need to get inside the beacon. Let's find a way in. Well, that hurt just as much as last time. Man, this tactic worked before. Just board it and then kill everyone with it. It's not working now. Sucks. So we'll do that instead. I'll do it. I'll get the job done. And we're out of the woods. Boop. That was easy. Was it? Let's see what's inside. Literally, how could anything be worse, though? I just don't get it. They better make that very clear by the end of the game. Okay. Let's do this. You know, this might actually work. Or maybe not. What is it? I can't construct the sequence. Well, not all of it. I don't have enough data. Then we get some more. What a shocker. I can't believe that the just one didn't do it. Man, I've never played a video game before. 
I do wish they tried to hide the very obvious padding a little better. <laughs> Feels like every game ever just goes, oh yes, you must just, one, one thing's not enough, you must get, oh, I was going to say three things, but I've just looked up in the top left, and in this case it's four things. You got family, Chief? Anyone special out there? No. Then why do you do this? Again and again. It's all I know. What about you? Do you have anyone out there? No. Not anymore. I'm sorry. It's... It's just been... So long since... Anyone's even asked me something like that. I... It's gonna be okay. We're with the Master Chief. He'll make it okay. Won't you? That is kind of my thing, yeah. Whoa! What cosmetic are we getting today? It's a fucking weapon charm. You know what nobody asked for or wants ever? Weapon charms. Like, cool novelty for the first 10 seconds, and then they distract you from the way they fucking jangle around and get glitch inside your gun and shit. <laughs> That is, uh, just, yeah, don't know, don't know why, well, I do know why, it's because they wanted to have more stuff to put in the battle pass, more stuff to sell on the store, but it's just like, nobody, nobody wants <laughs> weapon charms. Uh, right, let's go over there. Hello, lads. Lead the way, sir. Oh, I will. Oh, hey, forerunner thing. Forerunner thing alert. Shut the fuck up, you little grunty bitch. I've got a bad headache. Yep, you've got a bad headache, I know. I know, mate. Wow, that guy just fucking shat his pants and jumped off the map. Boop. We have done it. We have got invisibility. Hell yeah. Right, so it's right and then up, right? Yeah. To go pretty much instantly invisible for four seconds. Nice. Can I combo it? If I go invisible, can I then go invisible again and keep the invisibility? I can. Good. Hello. End of the line. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Fuck me. You hate to see it. You truly do. Oh man, look at that sky. Oh. <laughs>
Hi there. Holy shit. Didn't even give a fuck. Why is it not playing these ones automatically? I'm not even certain all of it is Forerunner, strictly speaking. Strands of this code are older than Zeta Halo itself. Possibly older than the Forerunners themselves. How? For all we know about them, there's so much we don't. Where the fuck is this thing, man? Like, I could jump off the edge and see if there's some, like, little hole that you're supposed to jump into, but... I don't know, it just seems weird. Like, shouldn't it just be here? Wait, it's here. So it's not exactly... Hmm. Oh boy, a nameplate. It's just what I always wanted. Yeah, why do the Forerunner ones not play when you hold it down? Bullet for Grunt. Poor Grunt. Betrayed by his own fucking team. Well, you can't be betrayed by not your team. But you know what I mean. is up a mountain. Can we get a view? Not really. HVT in range, Chief. Zeratus the Scourge Maker. He sounds... unpleasant. Taking him down would buy the UNSC more time on this ring. What do you think? I think it sounds like a fucking excellent idea. Whoa! Oh, there he is. Nice. Okay, that went pretty smoothly. Once we deal with the crew, we'll be all done here. This is what we like. We like cover. We like cover in a decent location. of Zeratus the Scourge Maker. May his stupid nickname die with him. Yep. We're thinning out the numbers of banished elite on this ring. Keep it up, Chief. Oh, I will. They will all be dead by the time I'm done. Still have some beacons left to find before the Forerunner sequence is complete. Which one's next? Okay, should we give this one a shot? Apparently, it's tracking. Could be cool. Let's see how it works against... Our resident thought over here. Just what I wanted to do.
HVT in range, Chief. Captain Arthok. A really nasty one, according to his rap sheet. He took out three ODST squads in a single op. Don't underestimate him, Chief. I won't. Yeah, it seems uh, pretty good. Wow. <laughs> yup. That's a wrap on the target. Let's clean up the rest of them. I'll be having this. Thank you. I want to grapple that. I don't want to destroy it. He's cheating. <laughs> Who's even left? Oh, hi. As expected, Arthok was no match for you. Well, as I expected anyway. I bet he was surprised. Arthok wreaked havoc on UNSC colonies for years. No doubt about it, he got what he deserved. Nice. Scorpion unlocked! Oh boy. Oh boy. We're in the big leagues now. We are in the big fucking leagues. Okay. So, now if we head down there, there's a Spartan core. A Spartan core blimey. Hey, bro. going down. Nice. That'll do it. That'll get it done. A squad of humans? It's just me, mate. Fuck. Oh, nearly. Nearly. Oh, we got it! Uh, I don't think you will. Oh, did that kill him? Okay, nice, nice. Should we go kill Barath while we're up here? Wait, that's not electricity, is it? What was that? Uh, stalker rifle. No, okay.
Hello, Barath, me old chum. I bring you death from above. Oh god, that one just spawned in very suddenly. Watch your head, Chief. A high value banish target's nearby. A jackal sniper called Barris. Intel says he's a crack shot, but you're a better one. Go get him. Intel says he's a dead man. Target elimination confirmed. Not out of the woods yet. Finish Damn, the UNSC were like, this guy's this guy's top of our priority list. He's really tough. We'll need more data to we're not going to use any air system. vehicles to just fly Let's above him, though. Beacons. Over the however many years he's been in service. Like, obviously, there's AA guns here, but... Oh, shit. Shit. I hate the Banshee. Did I mention? The Banshee is absolute garbage compared to the Wasp. The Wasp is like... You don't have to move around. You just hover and fucking own. And the Banshee, you're always fucking moving and it sucks dick. Target down. Let's deal with the leftovers. Have I just made the same mistake? No, it's okay. Got out of that one. Down. And just like that, life for the UNSC on this ring just got a little safer. Nice shooting, Chief. Cheers, bro. Stalker rifle ultra. We'll need Where more that data at? to reconstruct the forerunner sequence. Let's find the remaining beacons. Is... No, where where's the stalker rifle ultra dropped? They always drop it for you to immediately pick up. Was it up there? Yes. Looking snazzy as fuck. Okay. Got a thingy over there. Please, nobody take my shit. What armor will we get today? Oh, it's an emblem. Nice. Imagine. Imagine if they'd put cool-ass armor in these places instead of shitty fucking, like, nothingy emblems and charms. The occasional coating when they're not busy selling you red in the store for, like, ten quid. Little exaggerated, it was like seven quid, but still, it's the color red. The color red for seven quid. The color red that you get free in every other game for seven extra quid. And then, if you want blue, that'll be a further seven. 
absolutely insane prices. Oh shit, right, doesn't pause, doesn't pause, okay. Momentarily forgot, doesn't pause. <laughs> right, okay, so, uh, let's go to this beacon. Is that the one we already were at? Is that where we were before? Another beacon, another part of the sequence. What the fuck? Plan B seems to be working out just fine. Holy shit. That's not good. We fight for the banish. Good spot, good spot. Another beacon, another part of the sequence. Plan B seems to be working out just fine. Power and speed of my hand. No, I want to hijack it, not fucking. You simply make yourself an easier target. Can you not hijack wraiths? Is that not a thing? It like just put me on top of it to plant a grenade. I want to hijack it. I wouldn't know because you never ever see a wraith in multiplayer, so you never get the chance to experiment with them. Another beacon, another part of the sequence. Plan B seems to be working out just fine. Oh, well, this is fun. New plan. Let's go take this fob base, which we have a scorpion waiting for us at. Let's rock up in a fucking tank. How about that? Beacon, another part of the sequence. Plan B seems Let's rock their world fun. in a tank. Really? From how far away? From how far away were they hitting me there? Incredible. Another fob platform, Chief. Claim it. Fucking ow. Kilos all clear of banished. And once we capture it, it'll stay that way. Boop. Shouldn't be much farther, sir. Hangar bay is ahead. Chief, we've got two featherheads at 10 o'clock. If you can cover me, I'll get a beat on them. The fuck is a featherhead? A jackal? Chief, we've got Spartans pinned down across the way. Let's get them some help. Acknowledged. 
There's too much enemy fire, Captain. On your feet, Marine. I've known the Chief to do a lot of things over the years. Failing isn't typically one of them. Indeed. And just like that, this fog is ours. Banished records suggest this location is surrounded by key forerunner structures. Oh Christ, Until there's the another one. Until the was located, Esherim directed the bulk of his efforts on surveying this region. I wonder, what did he learn here? Rith Kull. Still have some beacons left to find before the forerunner sequence is complete. Which one's next? Rith Kull was born in the Tower of Vetnos on the asteroid of Azd. One of the only cities on this colony to remain of this colony to remain unaffected by the constant threat of piracy. After the Great Schism, her name rose to prominence in Tartarus's circle, oh yeah, largely due to her intellect and strategic wisdom of space warfare, which earned her the role of naval combat architect. Functioning in this capacity, Rith managed to take down over 185 UNSC capital ships, making her one of the most lethal Covenant assets in space. When the Covenant finally came to an end, however, Rith took her frigate Dagger of Mercy and its crew and continued ransacking Forerunner relic sites and trading them in the burgeoning post-war cross-species black market. Although lucrative, she desired to return to warfare and sought out Atriox for placement in the Banished. Alrighty. LZ confirmed. Standing by. I would like a fucking tank, please. Scorpion. Thank you. What the hell are you planning that requires us? You know what? Just ne never mind. Stand by. Wait, no, that's not what I wanted. It was always just one to the left before, but now we've got a few other things in the way. That's what I want. And I guess I'll take a refill of Stalker Rifle Ultra. Alright. There's the beacon. Let's go and make friends with it. <laughs> 